Okay, thanks for watching. Now I kind of want to explain what we're doing at Skill Masters FC because it's not just a place for video tutorials on how to do the skills or even them for them to be able to upload the skills. And even though my insight I think is better than anything I've ever seen and the skill upload is, is a neat feature that I really haven't seen other places, the idea is for them to get engaged a little bit and that's why we create them their own page. So we create them their own page and then they can kind of, we can use technology to their advantage and then it's instead of them being on them looking at Instagram or whatever they have, Snapchatting or TikTok, whatever these things are, if you're a kid listening to this, any of those things, it's, it's okay to do some of that, but let's use technology to our advantage and not to uh, distract us from our goals. So one of our goals is obviously to be a good soccer player as good as we can, right? Because we played a lot and we enjoy the game and we're going to get more of that. So. What we have here is a demo page. If you want to see this and scroll through yourself, go to other page and then you'll go to demo. It's right here on the right. Go to the other section. Um, okay, when we go in here, you'll see uh, we have the name the player name of the player will be here. I just copied the page of one of my current players who's um, in the program right now and has finished one skill. So he's a level one skill master. Right now, every skill they finish they be, that gives them a new level so he there's only two skills so they can only be level two right now but there will be more skills in the future so right now he is a level one skill master maybe a level two soon he has the scissor master class now the new video that just came out um, but you'll see here here's the skills he's attempted he's currently attempting the scissor master class if you click on any of these right here he's attempting the pullback tuck which ones has he accomplished um, he's accomplished the pullback tuck and you, if he has sent in the upload and he clicks on here, he'll be able to click on this link and it will take him right to where it is. And here's the video. We'll kind of listen to this a little bit. So to do that, the video is already playing, but you'll click the volume button here. Here, your foot's opening up instead of your leg going outside. Your foot here, your foot's opening up, and then you're tucking under. You actually get better here as we go. Next couple reps, you start to pull your foot out a little bit more, but it's really, it's not a good... So you can see we do an analysis, and uh, later um, he sent me another video of the second run because he didn't accomplish it on the first run, but the second run, another video here, and uh, we kind of talk about the differences when he does them and, and how he's doing them well now, but um, you don't really need to see that. But you get the idea here. That's The, the, the idea is to show them um, that they can accomplish things and give them a way to kind of have – have a game out of it. So just going forward here, if you do want to upload the skill and you haven't seen any of that, you'll go to the skill upload page. It's right here. You'll click on that. It will take you to this page. You fill out all the information. You don't have to fill out the skill difficulty or the comments. You don't have to fill that. You can uh, upload a file or and you can add more files if you'd like of the skill. Um, and then if you'd like to buy it, you go here to shop. If you'd like to buy any skills or buy the skill analysis, you go to shop and then You'll have uh, all the different skills you can add to the cart. Check out. Pretty simple, I think. If you have any questions, let me know. Um, you can obviously uh, go to the skills page too. So um, in the skills navigation, this is under dribbling. And all the skills will be under here if you want to uh, look at those or purchase those as well. Um, the skill analysis, uh, I'll know. You purchase it, and then I'll know when you send it in which skill it is. So. You don't really have to put anything on there if you'd like. So that's a little bit more about what we're doing here. And like I said, get your player involved. Get them using technology. Get them challenged on effective skills. Thank you for watching me, and thank you for helping me help your children or you if you're watching this become a better soccer player.